Hello everybody. Welcome to my grammar pages. My name is Sandhya. Today I am ready with a new topic for you. And of course this is not very new uh, because we are already in a process of learning how to write a classified. Today I have brought one more category of writing a classified that is sales and purchase of property and goods. And let's get started with all the features that are required to write a beautiful classified following this. So first thing is, we all know that we need a heading for each and every classified. And for sale or for purchase, you can write either for sale or for purchase depending upon the way you are writing the classified. And you know that this heading should always be written in capital letters only. And coming to the next one, we have uh, three varieties of uh, the sales and purchase. You can go with property or you have even the vehicles and sometimes you have even the household goods. Suppose if you have taken the property in which you are putting it for the sale or if you want to purchase a property, you have to follow certain features. The first thing is you need to give the brief description of the property. So that is number of floors, the size of the property and number of rooms the property consisting of, the location and the surroundings and amenities along with you need to give the contact address along with the phone numbers. So this is all about the property. Coming to the vehicles, you need to mention the color of the vehicle. It can be a scooter, it can be a bicycle, it can be a car, it can be of any vehicle. You need to give even the model and the accessories you have in it and the year of your purchase the modifications you have done if if any modifications and the price you are expecting for the vehicle as well as if you are putting it for uh, i mean if you don't want to purchase the expected price or the offered price has to be mentioned and the mileage the vehicle is giving and the condition of the vehicle in what condition it is is it in a good condition or it, is it in a mint condition you need to mention it very clearly and along with that which is very essential for each and every classified that is contact number and address coming to the household goods mostly we don't have many features and my dear students you will not uh, most probably get this during the examination but as a part of this classified i'm just explaining what kind of features may be included in this household goods so condition of the household good the price you are expecting or offered i mean expected or offered and along with that you need to give the contact number and the address today in this class we are going to discuss the format as well as uh, i mean along with an example for the property sale and purchase of the property along with the vehicles now here is an example for the sale of a particular property as this is a minor discourse my dear children i have been repeating that all the minor discourses have to be placed in a box so for that I have opened a three-sided box and first thing you need to remember is the heading. Uh, as I have told you earlier, you can take either for sale or for purchase depending upon the purpose, the classified you are giving. And I have taken it as for sale. This comes under heading. You might have observed that I always take the heading in bold and capital, I mean bold capital letters uh, with the biggest font size. And uh, see. 3 BHK duplex house. This is the name of the property. So, triple bedroom duplex house is put for sale and with car parking, 3 kilometers from, you need to mention the place, name of the place here and uh, look at all these. I have taken in points in bullets let us see what these features are Kaveri water connection actually this is an ad which i have collected from the newspaper so it doesn't mean that you have to place only Kaveri water connection but but you have to mention the water connection whether uh, whether the house has a good water facility running water facility or not so that's why the drinking water facility has is coming from Kaveri river so i have taken Kaveri water connection EB bore with submersible motor. 
this is the running water facility i mean the drinking water facility and we have even the boat connection and uh, most of the people they are very particular about vastu and the facing that's why we have to mention whether what kind of facing does a property uh, is for i mean is there for north facing and as per vastu here i have taken a symbol so here in this connection i do want to tell you something like you can go with the symbols as well as the short form of the words let me tell i in the uh, uh, next thing i'll just explain where we can take even the short in forms not facing and as per vastu take doors with safety grill two by two digital tiles clear document title instead of writing cle or clear you can even mention clr which states that it is clear which is well known to everybody so you cannot take the short end forms in such a way that in order to confuse the readers you have to go with a familiar short end forms clear document title bank loan available so you need to mention it very clearly whether the property uh is giving any i mean uh, is there any feasibility for the bank loans or not that's why because uh if you don't mention this when most of the people do not approach definitely they'll call you with the phone numbers to the phone numbers and they definitely they'll ask whether the bank loan is available or not for that reason at the earlier stage itself we have to mention bank loan available uh if it is not available that also has to be mentioned and price negotiable already he has mentioned the price here 33.85 lakh rupees so which is very very cheap i don't know where this particular uh, property is located but in the newspaper he has given 33.85 lakhs which is very cheap because it is 3 bhk duplex house where in hyderabad or in any other city for such a less price we will not get such a good property and uh, again he has mentioned that the price is negotiable and for the next thing you need to contact madhusudan uh, and the phone numbers are given so this comes under contact information and this is the expected price okay all these come under amenities sorry amenities after the completion of this one you need to close the box and you need to see whether the entire information is under the word limit of 50 or not if it crosses obviously your marks your valuable marks are going to be detected from the paper so be careful you shouldn't cross the word limit and you have to give everything in detail which is given in the question paper question in the question paper you will be given only a little uh, i mean less of information based upon that one you need to give every detail Uh, uh in order to make the examiner understand now let's move on to this is about a property and now the next one will be about a vehicle hey do you want to purchase a car then why delay here i have brought a car a beautiful car for you in the form of a classified it's a very sweet simple classified with less features so let me explain what are all the features that are required if you want to put your vehicle on sale so this is the heading part as discussed earlier for sale comes under heading where you have to take it in the bold letters as usual and the car is mercedes benz and this is the name of the vehicle name of the vehicle and uh, c200 this is the model name of the model here compressor 2006 blue so this is the ear and this is the color of the vehicle new tires battery done 6000 65000 i'm sorry 65000 deal self driven sparingly used scratchless all these come under the condition of the vehicle so he has mentioned that it is it has new tires battery is it's just done only 65000 deal and self driven and sparingly used and you are going to get this car without any scratch scratchless and average 20 km a liter this come under comes under mileage and 25 lakhs 
such a beautiful price quotation so 25 lakhs and here is the person to whom you need to contact so this is ab singh and he has given his number this is the contact information of the person info of the person so that's all so it's very easy to remember suppose if you want to put something for sale or for purchase it's very easy to remember for vehicle just you give the heading you need to mention the condition you need to mention the color as well as uh, the mileage it is running and even the year of manufacturing and in what way uh, the condition of the vehicle is in so and just give the contact information that's all you're going to close the box and you're going to end up your classified and uh, that's all for today and i think uh, my class is a bit clear to you if the class is a bit informative and if it has helped you please share comment like and please do not forget to subscribe to my channel my grammar pages catch you soon with a new video thank you so much